theatrical debut for both very accomplished pro MMA fighters. Round number one. Black trucks for David the Caveman Rickles, white trucks for Cliff Wright. Straight right hand landed by Wright. It circles back to the outside. Rickles doing a great job of cutting off the ring. By doing that, I mean he's just mirroring to the right's hips. He's standing right in front of the whole time, not giving him a chance to move left or right. He's going to end up fighting exactly where and when Rickles wants. Rickles with the head movement. Big shots to the inside. Rickles loading up on that left hook. Now the half tie plug. Uppercut with the rear right hand from Cliff Wright. Keep budging, guys. Keep budging. 80 seconds remaining round number one. Almost a hammer fist there. Now a right up. to the body. Right to left on the exit from the left hook. Huge right hand. Right nearly going down, nearly touching his hand on the canvas. Eats the left hook. Right continuing the throw. Oh, Rickles Bunchy, right back moving. single-mindedly to the inside. You can tell who the, right. who's the bigger, stronger athlete at this right. point right now. Rickles is pushing around whenever he wants to. Right trying to work off of the jab, trying to reset from distance. Rickles again coming forward, loading the right hand, the level change right to the body. There's that single collar tie. Counter Punch rear right uppercut right. to the body from right. Break! Break! No! Break from Tom Sconzo, the call knuckle up right back to it. See right trying to slow the tempo of this fight down, Chris. Rickles trying to speed it right back up, exploding to the inside with volume. Huge rear right uppercut on the entry. That was slick from Rickles. Rickles continuing to throw. There's the hand fighting that Rickles was talking about that he was trying to work on and develop further in training. Parrying down his opponent's hands, snatching and throwing. That is the end of round one. In that corner, Bellator and Strikeforce veteran Joe Wilk. David Rickles' best friend, longtime training partner, emphatically trying to push Rickles to finish this fight in round two. Fighting and trying to slow things down. Rickles from oh. the Here's Here's left left up. Up. Right in all sorts of trouble, trying to hold on a barrage of punches, right, trying to throw back. And I'm just impressed that Clifford didn't fall down right there. It was a huge left hook he ate. Hey, break. Break. Quick break from Tom Sconzo. I think, I think Wright is starting to feel the desperation right now. Rickles' face is clean. Knows that he had Wright in trouble, but Wright trying to fire back. Hitting the underhooks is Cliff Wright. Both fighters so accomplished with their infighting, their dirty box. I mean, that's a huge right hand, right to the body. And again, Cliff Wright holding on. And again, he finds himself in all sorts of trouble. 60 seconds remaining round number two. Rickles sees the finish line, trying to reach it here in the second round. Rickles needs to work that body right now. Clifford covers the face right now. He's not covering the body. Credit to Cliff Wright, still standing. He has not gone down, but he has taken some massive shots from David Rickles in round one and here in round two. And Rickles off the jab for the entry. And once again, look how David Rickles tries to always get that head position right there. Right with the right hand to the body. Rickles driving right backwards against the ropes. Buries that right to the body, that's David Rickles. Rickles resetting, pulling Cliff right to the center of the ring. Lead left hook, nothing on that from right. Big jab from David Rickles. As Rickles hits him, I keep seeing Cliff right bend over. That's when that body punch needs to come in there. Or the uppercut. Double jab now from David Rickles. We are headed to round three. Once again, they didn't give him the, t uh, one guy yeah, didn't give him, one judge did give 10-8, the other two just did 10-9, but I did like what I hear from, from Clifford Wright's camp right there. They were saying he doesn't respect your power, you have to make him respect it. Rickles opening up with the triple jab. Overhead right on the entry for Wright, trying to throw more power. Double underhooks, and gets the break from Tom Sconzo. Right, coming forward again. Rickles using that to get back to the inside. Right to the body. Rickles on that single collar tie. Overhand right from Cliff Wright. More urgency in round three. Cliff Wright definitely throwing with higher volume. And more big shots from David the Caveman Rickles. I like how he shucks him off right there. He just shoulder shucks. 
off the, the clinch attempts by Clifford Wright in order to get back into some clean punches. Right, break, break, fight! Cliff Wright still coming forward. They can lead left uppercut, a bit audacious from Wright. That did take Rickles off his striking line. Keep fighting. He's coming with, with some odd angles and some wild punches right now. They, they might be effective, they might work, but it's gonna open yourself up for big punches if you don't land them. Big straight right hand again, Wright in trouble, circling out, eats another big right hand from David Rickles. Turns 360, loses his mouthpiece. Now he's just right, clinching right, right now. Right. Gonzo putting Not the cool. mouthpiece of right right back in. Lead left hook from Cliff Wright. It was so yeah, effective yeah, with that dirty boxing. More flurries to the inside right Push to the off. body. Huge left to the body. Cliff Wright is taking some massive shots from David Rickles. Still standing. But Rickles opening up a sizable lead in our feature fight as we are through three rounds. He's opened up a sizable lead right now. Knock it looks like the Wright's going to have to do some serious work here if he wants to get any kind of a, a chance to win the decision. Again, those are the official scorecards, real-time scoring in Kansas. So 30-27. All three Kansas judges' scorecards through three rounds. But Rickles is thinking, finish not thinking, unanimous decision win. Huge left hand, doubling the left hook, David Rickles, another big left hook. Rickles is doing something right, we haven't right, really right. seen much in here. He's working Knuckle and up. being able to get that, that tie. He's slipping off and being able to throw punches after it very effectively. Most people just wait for the referee right, to break the tie right. up. He's, he's pushing, he's fighting, he's using Stop. wrestling right. and, right. and good right. MMA fighting, to be honest with you, to land good punches in there. Right, using the underhook, using the rear right uppercut. Rickles walking through it. Rear uppercut to enter that time for David Rickles. Putting rope, putting right against the ropes again. Another big uppercut. Cliff Wright is taking some huge shots from Rickles, Chris. Yeah, he doesn't even, he doesn't, I don't know, he's got very tough skin or something. He's not cut open yet, I'm very shocked. Rickles driving in with that shoulder. Fight! 40 seconds remaining, round four of our feature fight. Push up, guys. Come on. Push up. Wright talked about throwing between 40 and 60% power. I don't think he has a choice but to try to open up on that. It's finally a cut. I just, I just jinxed him, I think. I was talking about it. The, the, the blood finally starts to flow from Cliff White's face. Time called by Tom Sconzo. And you see why that's a nasty cut above the left brow. Caveman over here doing some uh, some work on the crowd, talking to people, trying to get people hyped up for this. Always a showman. This fight will continue right back to it. Full credit to Cliff Wright. He has not gone down still in this fight. Full credit to David Rickles. He is looking really good. This is bare knuckle and indeed BKFC promotional debut. That's that from Rickles. You see that physical strength. There's that movement right there. He's creating his own openings right there. He's not waiting for the referee. All of them have never fought in their lives, by the way. Would tell you that in this situation, Rickles would take off the fifth and final round. I'm telling you, he will absolutely not take off the fifth and final round. Well, I couldn't agree with more, but, but you know, right, right now, he knows he has to win by knockout. He has to throw everything at it right now, unless he goes in and just, I want to survive mode. Left hook from David Rickles again. Rickles is thinking finish. He is not thinking unanimous decision win. Those are big uppercuts and a left hand. Right again, holding on. Another onslaught, barrage of punches. Rickles now to the body. Wait, wait. Yeah, we talked about it. Look who's doing the clinching right there. It's definitely not. It's definitely not the caveman. He's looking to throw punches. He wants to end this fight. Push off. Rickles continuing to throw. Rights to the body. Oh, good uppercut right there. Good refereeing from Tom Sconzo allowing that sequence. 
Rickles, some blood in his mouth. Other than that, his face relatively break, clean. Break, break. Now peace out again for Cliff Wright, right back in. More big swings on the inside, more big left hooks. That was definitely a hammer fist standing from David Rickles. Short left hand, overhand right. Full onslaught now from Rickles. You see the high volume going for the finish. 30 seconds remaining in this fight. Wright still holding on. Right is I cannot believe how tough this guy is. Rickles completely opening up for the finish. Wait, now wait, Rickles is cut wait. outside of his right brow. Rickles playing to his home state Kansas crowd. So what do you think? Is, uh, is Dave Rickles taking it off this round? Is he playing it safe this round? The naysayers of real-time scoring take note. <laughs> David Rickles going it, hard for the it. finish, and that is the end of the fight. Ladies and gentlemen, before we go to the decision, let's have a round of applause for these two bare knuckle warriors. After completing the scheduled five rounds, here are our score totals from our judges at ringside. Kevin Champion and Greg DeVilbis score the fight 50-45. Sam Kleinman scores the fight 50-43 to the winner by unanimous decision, Dave the Caveman Rickles. Hey, look what Daddy can do. Y'all can do anything. I love you.